Good morning, it's Tuesday, March the 9th, and you're watching Agoracom Small Cap News TV. I'm your host, Paul Kandakos. Agoracom TV is a daily, fast-paced show, bringing you the best press releases along with the halts at the open so that you can all be profit from them and potentially find your next great small cap investment. Folks, it's a relatively slow news cycle day. I've got nothing coming out of the Canadian side. However, I do have three press releases coming out of the U.S. side, and I've got two halts to report on the second segment. So without any further ado, let's get down to business. We've got uh, uh, the headlines dominated by U.S. news this morning. We're starting off with CDC Corporation. They trade on the NASDAQ appropriately under the symbol CHINA or China. They are global enterprise software, IT services, and new media company. They're announcing financial results for the fourth quarter ended December 31st, 2009. Got some highlights for you, which include fourth quarter revenue of $83 million. It's up from $76 million in the third quarter of 2009. We've also got the adjusted EBITDA in the fourth quarter of 2009 was $14 million, which represents a sizable increase of 56% from adjusted EBITDA of $9 million in the third quarter of 2009. So sequentially, it looks like they're growing very nicely. Uh, their balance sheet, from what I can see here, looks pretty strong. They've got non-GAAP cash and cash equivalents of $130 million. Companies last at $2.70. High of 392, low of 73 cents, market cap of approximately 286 million dollars. Now moving on to our next company, Ag Feed Industries, also on the Nasdaq, and once again appropriately under the symbol F E E D or Feed. They're announcing record levels of revenue in both of its operating units for 2009. We've got record revenue of $173 million, which represents an increase of over 20% from 2008. They've also, production levels, uh, also achieved record levels where ag feed produced 680,000 hogs and 117,000 tons of feed, which resulted in operating earnings of 31 cents per share, so nothing to sneeze at. Uh, the company had $36.5 million of cash and cash equivalents. Uh, let's see what else we've got. Their last at $4.51, high of $7.96, low of $0.92, cents, market cap of $232 million. And finally, we've got CDC, uh, CRIC, sorry. They're reporting fourth quarter and full year 2009 results. They trade on the NASDAQ under the symbol CRIC. They're a provider of real estate information, consulting, advertising, and online services in China. I'm going to be reporting on their unaudited financial results just for the full year ended December 31st, 2009. We're not going to talk about the fourth quarter numbers. Uh, for the full year 2009 highlights, total revenues were $95.7 million for the full year. It's an increase of 91%, so great numbers there. Net income was $55.6 million, or, .63, or 63 cents per diluted share. Uh, and that represents an increase of 151%. Uh, company is last at $10, high of 17.15, low of 7.88, and a market cap of $180 million. Now let's get on to the halts. I've got two for you. Orocan Resource Corp trades on the venture under the symbol OR.P, halted news. And Royal Laser Corp trades on the TSX under the symbol RLC, halted pending news. Thanks for joining us, folks. That's a wrap for today. Make sure you join us again here tomorrow. We've got more great press releases and halts at the open for you.